For this project, we had to make a contextual chatbot. This project was recommended by Grow, and the main thing we want to achieve from this project is to make the user interaction to get information, relevant information, interactive rather than static. Because currently, Grow has its FAQ section, that is the help section for Grow, but it is made up of static pages, so there is no user interaction involved. So through this project, we aim to make this process interactive. and hence we have built a chatbot for the same only grow related questions will be shown to me and i can actually click on these and uh, the uh, the relevant answer will be sent back mm-hmm. and another thing which we have uh, also implemented is for example if i go to gold mm-hmm. and if i say hi again so it will uh, as as expected it will show me gold related questions now for example if i ask it directly something like how do i take possession of my gold so what it will do is it will try to match this question with all the question it has been trained on and it will, it will re- return the most relevant answer also i can change the language of, of this question and still it will be able to identify that okay this question means that uh, i am asking about the possession of my gold which i have stored there is no wait time for the questions to get trained on so <laughs> this was the front end part regarding the tech stack we decided to go with django as we have built many applications in the past and for the api construction we are using the django rest framework for the front end part we are using html css javascript and bootstrap so we are using the sqlite database as our default database because uh, we were thinking of uh, relational database for the storing of uh, a few as well as maintaining maintaining the relational table and for the training of chatbot we are using the chatterbot library uh, which is uh, in ai ml based library for the training part we are planning to implement a function that can help in adding the dynamic questions as well as answer and i think uh, you had a very good approach different with different approach good approach actually i would say you had proactively identified the the questions in context of uh, where the user is in and uh, one of the good actually i would say point was uh, uh, the dynamic configurations whether it was the context matching or uh, uh for the questions or even adding of the que- uh, the adding a new question so dynamic configuration is very much appreciated at